Hello everyone, this is an update video to my last uh, entry about Oblivion Reloaded and uh, ENB settings. I noticed that I forgot to mention a few things and accidentally cut out the part where I was setting up the Oblivion Reloaded.ini. So I decided to come up with this little update and uh, uh, explain why some settings are set as they are here. Uh, the shader model 3 must be set to 0 when using with ENB. I don't have NVIDIA uh, card, so I set NVIDIA patch to 0. The render boost also caused uh, crashes or freezes of the game for me when used with the Oblivion uh, stutter remover. That's why it's set to 0. Then frame rate control is set to 1 and when we look at frame rate here it's set to an average of 50 and uh, the enhanced Oblivion Reloaded engine will try to maintain this uh, frame rate. Then we have combat mode and camera mode. Uh, instead of using Oblivion Reloaded uh, camera mode I use mods that uh, are doing a similar thing uh, um, with the mod that I use uh, I can see my own body my character's body but the hands and uh, the weapon drone is shown like uh, in the vanilla game so combat mode I also don't use this but uh, you can try it out same goes for equipment mode sleeping mode and grass mode Grass mode is set to zero, mm, grass is handled <coughs> by mods and by the settings in Oblivion Ini. So you can experiment and uh, change some of these settings to one uh, to have a more a full experience of uh, Oblivion Reloaded. This is my personal choice and also these settings work very well for me um, so then let's see I don't use camera mode frame rate is set to 50 as I mentioned the next thing is the shaders I use the water shader then I don't use grass precipitations HDR or POM this is uh, parallax uh, effect uh, this caused some textures to appear uh, not very well in my game combined with the ENB <coughs> I use the skin shader terrain shader and shadows blood is your choice I don't use it so this is for shaders then we have effects you can see underwater enabled Water lens and God rays, depth of field disabled because I use the depth of field of the ENB. Ambient occlusion is enabled, it is disabled in ENB, so I use the one from Oblivion Reloaded. Coloring is enabled, and special coloring settings are also applied uh, in the shaders in this. Same is for uh, depth of uh, same is for ambient occlusion then no cinema no bloom and no snow accumulation no blood lens motion blur is applied and the last one that is actually applied is the SMAA now purger last important thing here in this settings I have purger enabled and it should clean my memory from time to time I set the time to zero so well at least these settings seem to be working for me so that's for oblivion reloaded.ini the next thing that I owe you is a better explanation of uh, uh, the Oblivion stutter remover ini so have a look here the master settings manage FPS is re enabled replace heap is enabled critical sections B hook critical sections is enabled 
Then let's find heap. Over here. The I heap algorithm is set to 6 and the I heap size is set to 768 which is the same value as I have set in the more heap mod. 768 megabytes. Apart from that I did not change any settings. Um, so that's it for the uh, stutter remover ini, oblivion stutter remover ini. This file as well as oblivion reloaded.ini in that shape is in the 7-zip archive um, that you can use as a mod and install in your Vrybash after installing Oblivion Reloaded Ini and all these settings will be applied then exactly as they are here. Please mind, I'm using an AMD graphic card, Radeon, so that's why I do not use some of the features of uh, Oblivion Reloaded.ini and the ENB that might actually work with an NVIDIA card, but I can only say it as a theory because I have no uh, possibility to test it. So these settings, they are confirmed to be working perfectly with an AMD card. In my case it's R9 390 with 8 gigabytes of VRAM. They are confirmed to work with this card and they also should work with NVIDIA card because um, actually NVIDIA can use a couple more features that I am not using because I so so my settings are a bit more limited but they are safe to use with an NVIDIA card. If you have any questions feel free to, to post comments here on or on Bevilex guide uh, page on the Nexus. Also leave a like if you uh, if you find my videos useful and thank you for watching.